Yo. 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 What's up, peeps? Let's get into some cryptocurrency news. She wore an itty bitty teeny weeny yellow polka dot bikini that she wore for the first time today. An itty bitty teeny weeny yellow polka dot bikini that she wore for the first time today. Hey girl, how you doing? Polka what? Polka who? Polka dot. Alright, so today we are going to talk about polka dot, right? And whether you should buy it. Should you not? Is it too late? Let's get right into it. All right. Polka dot solves the interoperability problem by helping cryptocurrencies talk to one another. Think of it like computer operating system. You can't always transfer things easily from a Mac to a PC or a Samsung phone to an Apple iPhone. In the same way, you might want to, something that was built on an Ethereum network to interact with Bitcoin, BTC blockchain. Whether it's transferring assets from one platform to another, or creating programs that interact with programs on other networks, Polkadot is like a translator that helps them all speak with the same language. What it does, Polkadot helps different blockchain networks work with each other. All right, uh, let's see, it was founded back, it had the ICO back in 2017, and it was launched in 2020, all right? So I'll put a link to this article, all right? Now, should you or should you not buy Polkadot? So real quick, Polkadot pretty much, imagine a world where some of your friends have an iPhone, some of your friends have and Android, and some of your friends have a Windows phone. But imagine you guys can't communicate because these are different um, devices that are on different operating systems, and you guys cannot communicate. So Polkadot basically makes it easy. It makes it possible for all of these phones that are on different uh, operating systems to be able to communicate with one another. That's pretty much it good example of what it is an easy breakdown all right so let's get into more all right now i am on coin market cap right on coin market cap polka dot is ranked at number eight let me say that again polka dot is ranked number eight all right number eight it's currently at 33 dollars and 72 cents it's been down 3.63 percent since the past uh 24 hours volume is at 2.4 billion circulating supply 987 million all right let's look real quick all-time high on may 15 2021 was 49 dollars and 69 cents all right now this is all for a cryptocurrency that was launched in 2020 guys where were you at in august 2020 when polka dot was at two dollars and 87 cents all right where were you at ask yourself where were you at but have no fear it's not too late to hop on the polka dot train. All right. Polka dot is currently sitting at $33.76 as of today, which is September 17, 2021. So its all time high back in May was $49.69, May 15, 2021. This was when Bitcoin was high, cryptocurrencies had a lot of momentum. So pretty much, it's it's lost half of its value, all right? So if you buy some right now, there's a very high probability that you will double your money, all right? Now, let's look at the markets, the exchanges that it's on, all right? So it's on Binance. 
it's on who boy cave coin kraken and a lot of other exchanges right here but the most important exchange of them all the most important the big daddy the most important exchange that Polkadot is on is that it's on Coinbase. All right, Polkadot is on Coinbase. All right, it's on Coinbase. Coinbase. All right, come on, guys, it's on Coinbase. Um, it was launched back in June, I think it was, of this year that it got launched into Coinbase, guys. Guys. This price is legit. You, we don't even have to go any further about whether Polkadot is legit or not. At this point, if you're going to call it a scam coin because it's not Bitcoin, it's not Ethereum, then you're just a hater, right? Polkadot is a very good investment, all right? And it's very a legit project, all right? It wouldn't be on Coinbase if it wasn't legit. And look at all these exchanges that it's on. These are the top exchanges that you want your coins, your altcoins to be on, that you can only dream of, all right? So real quick, the Twitter. All right. So they've tweeted. The team tweeted seven hours ago. Let's see, September 16, 2021. September 16, 15. And overall, let's look even further. Right here. This is actually the, the Twitter page of the team. So you guys can re look at it. So it's a very active project. The team's active. They're always giving updates, all right? So it's not a scam, nothing dead. So we got that out of the way. Now, like I said, the most important part, grab your phone, grab your laptop, computer, desktop, iPad, whatever. Go to Coinbase.com. When you look at assets that you can buy, this is what you can see. Polka dot currently at $33.78. Alright. It's on Coinbase. You guys can buy you some polka dot on Coinbase. Alright. Legit. Legit project. Alright. Next thing, let's look at the Reddit page. So the Reddit page has 30,000 members. Very good. Very active, very big community. All right, so we've seen posts 12 hours ago, like seven hours ago, 20 hours ago. Why is this important? Just to make sure that whatever altcoin project that you're getting into, that it has a community. Keep in mind that the bigger the project, the more members the Reddit page will have. So basically back in 2020, August of 2020, practically a little bit a year and a month ago, I'm sh pretty sure Polkadot did not have 30,000 members. They probably had maybe 1,000 to 2,000. So keep that in mind when you're trying to invest in upcoming altcoin projects that their community may not be as big. But you just want to make sure that it's picking up momentum and there's people actually talking about it. So you're not getting into any dead projects. All right. And most important, technical analysis. All right. So. As we can see, this is the daily chart. I'm looking at polkadot.usd on Binance. I'm using TradingView. As we can see, Polkadot was in an upward trend from December of 2020, late December, going all the way up till April, April 16, 2021. It moved upwards. This was when momentum was hot. Bitcoin, crypto was everything that people talked about. That was the hottest topic. It boomed. It went up. It came from practically $5 end of December going all the way up to about uh, around $48, right? The purple lines are support and resistance, and this trend line right here that's orange is just a trend line of where direction of the market is going. So as we know, crypto took a correction. This is going to be a double run, okay, guys? It's going to be a double run, all right? 
just like 2017, 2013. We took a correction. We went down uh, all the way from starting from May, going all the way down to July. Now, just for you guys that are new to crypto, back in 2017, if you look at the charts, the same similar thing happened. We went on a double run, basically that that um, the entire market as a whole took a little dip over the summertime and then it picked up momentum towards the end of the year and then we went all the way up bitcoin hit 20,000 by december of 2017 and then all coins went very high and then picked up momentum by the beginning of january and then everything just crashed and we were in a bear market up until 2020 21 all right so with that being said polka dot is currently sitting at $32, actually $33.65, all right? So from end of July, this was when Bitcoin and crypto was picking more momentum for that second bull run that we're going to have. Polkadot went up from, guys, come on. where were you at, okay, if you don't have some? It was at $10 end of July. Right now, it's sitting at $33.65. So that was a 3x. For a coin that was ranked number eight. Guys, that was like free money right there. Come on. You gotta get some. Don't sleep on polka dot. Right? Now, with that being said, right now it's sitting at $33.69. It kind of went up to $40 and pulled back. The next big level of resistance for it to break through is gonna be around the $40. And once it breaks that, Expected to hit 45. Once it breaks through the 45, guys, Polka Dot is gonna end this year. I can guarantee you it's gonna touch over a hundred dollars. It's gonna be in the three digits, all right. Look at how crazy Solana went, all right. And there's a lot of other altcoins in the top 50 that went crazy. Right, and we're not even at the right now. We're moving towards the top of the market, but we're not completely there. We still have some time to go, guys. Guys, guys. I'm talking when I say guys, I'm talking about both men and women. You gotta get you some polka dot, all right? It's not too late to hop on the train, all right? I mean, it would have been good if you had, if you were a disbeliever, should have bought some back in ten. That was your second opportunity to get into the market again, to buy some end of July at like the $10. But if you're still on the fence, you still have an opportunity to at least three extra money. Today, I want you guys to buy you some polka dot, all right? Very good investment. It's on Coinbase, all right? It's already, it's all time high back in May was $49. And that was when Bitcoin had reached 65. Bitcoin is going to definitely reach 100,000 or close to it. So do the math on that. Polkadot is going to hit the three digits, all right? Maybe like $100, $120 is going to reach there, all right? Guys, get you some Polkadot, all right? And with that being said, I am out.